What's up guys, I'm Fatui and again here with a new unboxing video and this here is a special one. Deus Ex Mankind Divided Collector's Edition for the PC. So this came out today, just picked it up, it releases on Steam in around an hour or so. Um, this here is uh, the Collector's Edition with the the statue if you remember and you can check out the video uh, I'll leave a link in the description uh, of actually the other mankind divided box or not the human revolution box that I got and um, I thought it appropriate to pick this up and also because I'm really hyped for this game I loved human revolution it is a fantastic game I picked it up if you remember if you're an old time fan of this here channel or some of my videos, I picked it up on PS3. So after, after I finished it on PS3, I picked it up on PC, finished it on that, and I decided that the PC version is the way to go. I want that 60 plus frames per second, I want the quality, and I know they're good for it. And it's been getting a ton of great views. Instead of me talking about this, this game here, which I know you're interested in, but this here video is about the box. So the first thing we're gonna do is actually easy peasy open it up. So um, if I remember correctly, because uh, they have done an unboxing video of it already, um, Square Enix is actually, you open up the ends, and then you fold it out and to get inside of of actually the triangle. Uh, the next thing I remember is actually we're gonna pull this here out and leave that right here because that's the game and we're not interested in it right now. Right now we're trying to get out the nice triangle here so as you can see this here triangle is pretty much the centerpiece of it all we have the game which was covered inside the back what the real thing is that with this here collector's edition you get a part of the soundtrack you get the um, you get the statue you get the game i think you also get the season pass if there is a season pass i can't remember but let's actually open this here up. This here package is actually pretty, let's see if I can do this here with, with actually dropping anything. Maybe I can't, so I'm gonna do this. And hold it up right here. As you can see, there we have it. And it's actually a sample complete. The thing was that with the old one, let me get a closer look at it. With the old statue, it was more of an action figure quality. Uh, this here is definitely higher quality. Um, the thing is, there are some things you can uh, change, and you can do you can do the same thing with the um, with the other one. So we have, of course, the art book right here. We have a hard case for the game, metallic hard case, and we have the statue itself, um, which is, let's see, uh, it's actually placed on uh, some plastic right here. So it's like sucked in and without breaking anything easy peasy, there we go that back and as you can see we have it right here we have uh, some information here we have uh, information on the back which is of course the trademark cause and this is not a toy it is a statue it's the centerpiece of it all and here as I talked there are some holders right here where you, and there's also you can switch out Right now, you can switch out 
the part of the gun so it's actually a sniper, if I remember correctly. Or you can switch it to, let me see. I think there should, this here is actually the perfect part. And I actually do not know if there's like something to hold it up or anything. Looks a bit silly, but yeah. Not gonna need that, I think, to hold it in place. But yeah, that's the statue. It has like a silencer. Uh, Pretty easy to pull in. If you remember, you could actually move the hands on the old statue and you could actually switch out the weapons he had. So they uh, actually had a little bit left, the idea of it. And this here is the thing that he's on, is, uh, has around it, is actually a new armor piece that is a part of the game, which I haven't actually heard a lot about. But I am interested in checking it out. And, I'm, and I am a stealth guy, so I like doing stuff. So let's check out this here great uh, metallic case, as you can see. Uh, it holds the game if you want to. It is a great centerpiece also. Uh, it has the same art style as the first game, as you can see. So really, really cool. I am... I've never been a fan of these here metallic boxes, as in like using them, uh, but uh, I like collecting them. So we have the art style here, you have everything around here, and I think you can see here that there's X Universe, uh, some information about who's behind the project, characters in the game. We have Jensen, as you can see right here. Uh, really, really cool and all the other things. I don't wanna actually spoil all of it for you guys and I actually don't wanna spoil it for myself because I actually do not know all the characters in the game. So, that is it for, uh, for this here. So let's put this back. The assembly of, uh, of it is pretty simple goes back nice and snugly so that's pretty cool we are right here so let's switch over to what we have right here so and this here is the poor important part the game or not the important part but the second most important part so we have right here the game um, there is probably inside of it some um, a key or of some kind which we all love uh, and uh, this here is the day one edition. Um, and we have like information who is behind it and all that. We have some uh, feedback on what's on, a, on a, the, st the system requirement. It is a little bit beefy. We recommend a Windows 10, iCore 3770K, uh, or a equivalent uh, AMD FX for 8350 um, Wraith. 16 gigabytes of memory, um, RX 480 for 1080p or a 790 for 1080p on a, the equivalent of video. And, and a DirectX 12 is recommended. It's 55 gigs of installment. So pretty beefy. Uh, 10 gigs less than G, uh, GTA 5 actually when it launched. And that's the recommended requirements, just FYI. So let us actually go over and where did I? And check this here out. There we go. And as soon as I'm done here, I am gonna go and get this game started. So we have, this here is a multiple DVD, I hope. Uh, game so I think it's three or four uh, one of them was loose but that uh, you couldn't couldn't expect other than that we have like uh, Deus Ex Go which is also available for uh, the App Store where Apple and, uh, and Google Store so here we have the key also where you know 
I'm not going to show you this because I'm going to use that at the end. And we have the game. So yeah, that is the day one edition. And as I can only say, I am a big fan uh, of the game. And yeah, uh, I, I really like this here edition. Uh, I think it's equivalent quality to, um, to the other one that I have. And I'm gonna put this up next to next to the other um, the other statue that I have of him. So yeah, that's pretty much it for uh, for me this time. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video here. If you did, please hit that like button. If you didn't, hit that dislike button. And also, if you leave a comment and comment on the video or give me some feedback on what I did good or bad. That would help me out. Follow me on Twitter at Fetui, F-E-T-T-O-U-H-I. You can also check me out on Instagram at C, F-E-T-T-O-U-H-I. And I don't mean like C because you're not going to see that much. Trust me. Just pictures. Get your head out of the gutter. Anyways, C as in the cattle, C, Fetui. The asshole that took the, uh, my, the other one was um, somebody else, so I had to check that. I think it actually pretty good. See if it's that's, that's catchy. I, I think so. I don't know. Anyways, thank you for watching. Until next time, bye.